Are you a fan of the sleek looking Kia Carnival minivan? Well, get ready for some exciting updates. Before we dive into the details, make sure to hit that subscribe button, give this video a like, and share it with your friends. The fourth generation Kia Carnival was first introduced in 2020, but the automaker is planning to tweak its styling as part of an upcoming mid-life cycle update. This will bring it more in line with Kia's current and future lineup, including the EV9-inspired LED headlights and taillights. But that's not all. Rumors suggest that a hybrid variant may also be in the works. The minivan will still be recognizable from its proportions, greenhouse, blackened A-pillars, sliding doors, and roof rails. However, the front and rear ends will be extensively redesigned. Up front, it will get vertically stacked LED headlights and a new grille, giving it an SUV-like appearance. At the back, the slim taillights will be replaced with boomerang-shaped units. The Carnival is closely related to the Sorento, which is also getting a similar facelift next year. In fact, all Kia models are likely to adopt the new design language featured in the fully electric EV9 SUV flagship. In terms of powertrains, the Kia Carnival is rumored to be getting a hybrid option. Reports suggest that the electrified powertrain will be sourced from the Kia Sorento and Hyundai Santa Fe. The Sorento Hybrid currently produces a combined 227 GP, 169 kilowatts, 230 PS, while the Sorento Plug-in Hybrid delivers 261 GP, 195 kilowatts, 265 PS. The current Carnival is expected to see a refresh around 2024. We don't yet know if the next-gen Carnival will arrive for the 2025 or 2028 model year. In terms of pricing, the current Carnival starts at just over $34,000, making it far cheaper than the nearly $39,000 Honda Odyssey. So there you have it. The Kia Carnival is getting some exciting updates in terms of styling and powertrains. What do you think of these changes? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more automotive news and updates. Thanks for watching.